This week's trend started with actress Tony Abraham whipping online after she had arrested a Twitter user for defaming her. Now, Rema took center stage for two reasons, his new album soon to be released and his performance at Asian's Richest Family Wedding. Davido closed the trends for this week by launching his new social media app. Join me on Spiddar as I give you all of the trending stories and more that made it to the top this week. Singer Arya Star has become the most streamed Nigerian artist on Spotify globally. This achievement was announced by Fiona Akumo, Spotify's head of music for Sub Saharan Africa, at a press conference in Lagos. Arya Star's collaboration with Rao Alajaro on Santa and her solo track, comma, took the top two spot while Thames Love Me JJ came in third, showcasing the talent of Nigerian artists on the music streaming platform. Nollywood actress Tony Abraham, in a few response this week, has expressed her determination to stand up against those who have been harassing and bullying her. This follows Tony Abraham's arrest of an ex-user who wished death upon her son a few weeks ago. Now, during a recent Instagram live session, the actress expressed her frustration over the persistent online bullying. She stated that she was ready to face any consequences but would make sure to deal with everyone who bullied and defamed her before then. And now, Afrobeat singer Rema this week leaves fans eager for more as he announces the release date for his second upcoming album titled He Is. The singer, who recently argued his sport among Afrobeat Big 3, Whiskey, Davido and Bonoboy of course, shared a clip of his upcoming album cover on the X platform. Rema hasn't released any album since his first studio album Rave and Roses released in March of 2022. The album features hit tracks such as Calm Down, Divine and Songazin, showcasing the Nigerian artist's signature blend of Afropop, R&B and Rap. He has now announced the release date for his second to be on July 11th this year. Another highlight for Rema this week was him giving a spectacular performance at the wedding of Anat Mbani, son of India's richest man, Makash Mbani, and Rikaida Manchant, daughter of famous pseudo cool tycoons Viran and Sheila Manchant, had service online. The video shows the Maven record superstar performing his global heat calm down at the lavish ceremony, creating an unforgettable atmosphere that had guests dancing and singing along. The event, which was a talk of all of Asia, saw the Afrobeat star allegedly pocketing a whopping sum of $3 million, approximately 4.5 billion naira for his performance. Among the notable attendees was Bollywood superstar Salman Khan, who was seen enjoying Rema's performance. And finally, on trendy stories that made it to the top this week, Nanjo musician Davido has launched a new social media application called Chatter. The musician used his social media account to announce the app's release. He gave a brief history of the development of the software and its feature with his friend and co-owner, Sa Banco. The music icon posted information about Chatter, a social audiovisual utility platform that connects content creators to a lively community and helps them magnify their voices. In the past eight months, the video has undertaken three internet projects. Recall that the musician introduced his cryptocurrency, however, the dollar Davido coin fell a few days after it launched, prompting some cryptocurrency fans to call it a, a scam and a rock pool. And just about that, I come to the end of Trendy Stories that made it to the top this week. Which is your favorite? Which did you think I kept out? Say it in the comment. Thanks for watching. Signing out.